I swear everybody, it's one thing about YouTube that I hate is when I do a video and now I got Windows 7 on the computer so I moved the um, mouse to the edge of the page or something and shut the whole thing off. Look, I'm tired of doing videos 15 or 20 times or 3 or 4 times and it walk. So I'm going to break it down. The name of this video is called When a Man Loves a Woman. And what I want to ask women is this. When your man is trying to give you affection and you don't want to give him affection back, what are you thinking? Now, I don't know what happened before, you know, you and your man got to a certain point. But I do want to know what you're thinking when your man is trying to give you affection and you're not letting him get any. In other words, it's not the sex. It's like, how you doing, baby? Can I get a hug? <clears throat> Why y'all be doing that sometimes? Not because I got drama at home. I try. I, I hate doing four or five videos because now when you do a video, you sound rushed. A lot of these other people who do their videos, like all the so-called partners on YouTube, they have scripts. They actually sit down and write some shit, a monologue and a whole damn thing down and try to do a video. Not here. I'm not trying to be Jay Leno. I'm not trying to do none of that shit. I just want to do my videos, ask some questions, get some feedback, let my people understand I'm real. I'm not asking questions just for me. I'm asking questions for other people. People ask me to ask a question. I put it all on me. I had you answer me for them. So listen, here's how I go. Airplane going by, listen. They're still leaving Bohemian Grove, which is less than 20 miles from my home. Less than 15 miles. Less than 10 miles. So listen, when a man loves a woman, sometimes in relationships you grow away from a person. You don't, have, look, in the first video, I mentioned a girlfriend I had, and every time I saw this girl, she told me how much she loved me. Blah, blah, blah. She told me, I love you so much. I told her, baby, don't tell me I, you love me because I feel it. Then she started fucking somebody else. And when I didn't hear it, it was like. You don't even hear the airplane, do you? And I learned a lesson. You never tell somebody that tells you that they love you. Don't tell me that because I feel it. They stop feeling you that way. So listen, what I want to say is this. Sometimes when you get in these relationships with people, the things be all fine in the beginning, fine and dandy. And then all of a sudden, you guys just don't talk. You guys don't communicate. And then one person tries and the other person don't. Now, what I want to ask the people out there that watch me is this. If you was a man... And you was in a relationship and you ask her, hey, baby, I love you. And you just trying to show your affection and she rejected your affection. How did you feel? And I want to ask the women out there who watch my show. When you reject a man's affection, why? What is the purpose of saying, turn up your nose? Because even if a man did something wrong and you feel as if you want to punish him, when you reject a man's affection, it don't come around much longer. Once a man's affection was rejected, he ain't bringing it no more. So when you reject a man's affection, now knowing the consequences of that, what is going through a woman's mind? Say you and him ain't spoken in a couple days because of whatever. Bills, drama phone, leaving lights on in the house, toilet paper, mist, whatever. Cooking, not cleaning up, or, you know, messed up friends. When you reject your man's affection, what is going through your mind? If this video, I should put for blacks only. Listen to, listen to the birds. If I put for blacks only on the video, more people will watch it. Is ignorant as that sounds. 
it sounds as if black people don't want other people to learn something or understand something, so then they're like, shit, if they doing it, I can get in there. I'm not going to do that to this video. The name of this video is When a Man Loves a Woman. I should just put a question mark on there just to mess with people so people watch this video. So listen, sometimes us men, we do some dumb shit. Might go spend too much money, might stay out too late, might fuck up, might be messy, might be slobs. And then we come home and our women who are angry for whatever reason, I'm not asking you your reasons until you tell me. Because what I want to know is when we fuck up and we try to be affectionate, why do you reject that? That's the only question I want to ask. I mean, when the guy's trying to be nice after whatever situation, you guys could have argued and the guy's trying to be nice and you reject that. Or, you know, he's just trying to be nice and you neglect him. Or you like, you know, what? Why do women neglect our affection as punishment? Maybe that's the best way to put it. When a man says, baby, I'm sorry, regardless of whatever he did, and for whatever long period of time that you want to put on it, why is it that you disregard a man's affections? And that's the only question I'm asking. I don't ask questions like this. But if any real women out there, and any real man's out there listening to this is like, yeah, I've had an argument with my woman. All of a sudden, she won't talk to me for a week, three days, four days, five days, you know, whatever. But when the woman argues with the man and there's an argument, sometimes, man, we, we argue hard and fierce for five, ten minutes and the argument's over. And I, our, our, our shit is forgiven. Shit. What was the argument about, honey? Doesn't matter anymore. question is this why do women deny a man's affection in other words if anything was to have gone wrong and we try to make it up when you deny our affections our affections become less and less likely to happen again in other words, over the course of a relationship, being denied the acknowledgement of a man trying to give an affection or any affection to their woman, it's like, oh, get on over there. Don't talk to me. Whenever you do that, that lessens the chances of us doing it again. What I'm trying to say for the last time, because I don't know how to get this out, is why? Do you reject our affection? Period. And who told you to do this? And why do you wait and do this? Why do you do this for so long? In other words, what I want to really understand is when a man is trying to be nice to a woman that is his woman or a woman that he wants to get with, why is there a great need for rejection? In this day and age, rejecting a man is not going to make one come back. So that old saying, playing hard to get, does not work anymore. Especially when you already got the man. Could some woman out there answer the question, what happens when a man loves a woman and a woman don't care? don't know, don't understand, or don't give a fuck. Even if it's the man she loves. Answer the question. Can you? Is any woman out there got the guts to answer the question? I know there's a lot of men going to tell me, yeah, I was rejected, man, I did this. And then the woman said, you know, hey, you know, fuck it, it's over. And the next thing you know, man, she's a crackhead, man, motherfucker's pimping her. Tell the stories. Tell the truth. You rejected him, why? And it thought you, you thought you was going to get what from it? You've been tubed.